Alrighty, folks, it was a warm day yesterday, not far off our normal here in Springfield. Much hotter weather, though, off to the west. 95 in Joplin, 100s off in Kansas and Oklahoma. 98 Chanute, and uh, it was a little better. Okay, here, still hot. Yes, still humid. Yes, low 90s, but pretty typical for July. Today, we're going to heat things up just a bit more. Okay, we have a heat advisory in play for this afternoon and Tuesday afternoon area wide. Anywhere you look, got a heat advisory in play for heat index values 105 to 110 for both today and for tomorrow. And then the good news is that's it. A shift in the pattern brings in some cooler air. Looks like it's going to stay for a while. Great news there, but the high pressure, the heat dome right now spinning over the four corners area. Here it is that clockwise motion, high pressure. There you go from left to right. Uh, we're right on the edge, the eastern edge of that high pressure. What's up to the north and east of us is we're going to find our cool down right now. The storm track is going through parts of Minnesota, northern Iowa, Wisconsin, and parts of Illinois and Indiana. One storm system here over Michigan, another one coming up in the northern plains and parts of Minnesota right now. That track is going to shift down to the south and west a bit as we go into your Tuesday night and Wednesday. As a cold front comes in, area of low pressure drops down over the Great Lakes and some cooler air floods in to the Ozarks. That'll be really, really nice. But for today, tomorrow, yeah, it's going to be warm. A few clouds out there for this morning, but we should be seeing mostly sunny skies for later this afternoon. 74 degrees, south winds, 5, 10 miles an hour for this morning. Very humid. Dew points right now near 70. That's the oppressive category, so get ready for it. Mid-70s here in Springfield and off to the east of Highway 65. In the west, where they were in the 100s yesterday, they're close to 80 for this morning. 79 Nevada, 78 Joplin, 78 down in Fayetteville as well. For the rest of the day, yeah, mid-90s, feeling like the triple digits for later today. Winds a little breezy, a few clouds this morning, but we'll see again plenty of sun later on for today. So take a look at Futurecast. It's pretty quiet today, not much happening there, just a hot day. We go into Tuesday, maybe a round of maybe some showers across central Missouri for Tuesday morning. Mostly dry, though, but we will see some clouds develop in the area already for Tuesday morning. Remaining partly cloudy, maybe a hit or miss rain shower during the daytime Tuesday but still looking like a hot day. Here's your front coming in, all right? Better chance of the rain develop here and thunderstorms for Tuesday night, evening. We'll say 7, 8 p.m. at the earliest. Midnight, 1 a.m., 2 a.m. rain continues into your Wednesday morning. By Wednesday afternoon, it begins to break off a bit. Maybe some lingering activity for Wednesday night. Thursday, we are dry. How much rain are we looking at from this for Tuesday night, Wednesday morning? Could be heavy in some areas. We'll go ahead and say a half inch to an inch. So what's going to happen? Well, the rain comes in with a cold front and milder air sneaks on in as well. Back to the low 80s. Mid 90s for today, mid 70s overnight tonight, mid 90s for Tuesday. There's a chance of seeing maybe some strong to severe weather along that front when it comes on in for Tuesday night. Wednesday, plan for a rainy day. Low 80s though, doesn't stop there. Low 80s continue for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and even Sunday. A long stretch of very nice weather. Yeah, that cool down going to be welcome after this stretch of heat, Tom. Thanks.